Masterclass is an elite training course which allows account managers who believe they've reached the top of their game to broaden their horizons, gain far greater understanding of all media platforms, um, and then have the knowledge and ability to execute solutions. Feel good all weekend. From the business point of view, um, our objective was actually at the outset solely retention. The training cost a little in excess of £33,000. Feel good Friday. If we projected forward the 18 months the programme would run, if we'd retained most of those key staff, then you know, that would have been a win for us. Um, but that peer group decided almost on day one, we want something else. We stood there and said, right, what's all this about? OK, well, we'll write a million pounds of brand new revenue um, by the time the course is finished. That it was a financial goal uh, was clearly um, a delight to us as a business. That that goal was a million pounds of incremental revenue was a double delight. One of the challenges that the teams had was to go away and come back with a presentation around Sonic, so using audio in order to be able to communicate ten things about themselves. Pac-Man was my first love. The whole point is if you're selling radio, you are selling sound. We've realised, certainly as a business, that sound should be the first thing that we present to any client when they're looking at a solution for radio. What we got them to do is to take two or three points back to each of their sales teams and then share that, you know, learn something, break it down and pass it on. Going back to the original objective, of course, number one position has got to be it did what we planned for it to do. The retention was there. But the sense of momentum that built with that group of dynamic people coming together saying, we really, we want to do this, we're really engaged. It was so wonderful and so refreshing. For me, um, I think part of the reason of getting involved in Masterclass and really, really driving it forward is that it just we needs to bring back the passion of, of why we're in radio. Why do we sell it? This is hard. Why do people want to buy it? Why do they put money into their logos and their jingles? It's because actually it's exciting.